Now deceased veteran Rotarian Sam Owori was to have assumed the presidency of Rotary International in June next year, making him only the second African to head the movement in its 112 years. However, the stream was cut short following his sudden demise on 13th July in Dallas, USA, due to complications after a leg operation. Now, for the first time in its history, Rotary International will set up a fund towards poll elimination in honor of Owori. And Sam Owori has been the first person to pass on at that level. We've never lost anybody uh, in line of world leadership. No past, no sitting area president or president elect or even president nominee has ever passed on. So the first time such a thing is happening. According to past governor of Rotary District 9211, Stephen Mwanje, the fund is a manifestation of Owori's contribution in serving humanity. This is the first time I'm hearing of such. That, that shows the, the level, uh, the amount of respect and uh, and how and the name of Sam Ori in the Ottawa world. So details of this fund will be given by Ottawa International, but for now suffice me to say that has been great, greatly honored by Ottawa International as an organization. The deceased was a member of the Rotary Club of Kampala for 38 years. He would always be humble and he would always present a cause and say, let's get this done for humanity. And for that, we will always miss Sam Ori in our club. Or his body will arrive in the country on Monday and will be buried on Saturday in his home in Nagongera, Tororo district. On Tuesday, the 25th, the body will be taken to Parliament of Uganda at 11 in the morning for viewing and to stay in Parliament until 4 p.m. that day. On Wednesday, the 26th, all Rotarians in the district and beyond will be attending an interfaith service in honor of our fallen hero. Owori, who died aged 76 years, previously served as Director of Uganda Commercial Bank and Executive Director Africa Development Bank, among others. Some of the mystified leadership of Rotary in Uganda. You may want to know that Sam was the first person from this country and this part of the world to become our director. He was the second, uh, first person again to become trustee of the foundation. And naturally has been the very first one to become Rotary International President, nominee and then elect. But because before Sam came on, we didn't believe that it was possible for Uganda to ever occupy those offices. So Sam leaves us with that confidence. He was said to be Rotary International's 108th president, and his one-year term would have begun on 1st July 2018. In August, Rotary International will begin the process of electing a new president, Shirant Hochre, NTV.